versus Egosan nahirapan niya ng friend? I think it was the adjustment with the, the game style eh. and then you follow through talaga ng isang plan. So we have like plans just before like, every game. Fortunately, hindi siya nasusunod. So, yeah, I think that's one of the uh, key aspects na kailangan namin makakayot siya this, this time. Do you think, Coach, na despite the loss, this would help Brent in the coming sea games and IESL uh, tournaments? We'll definitely use this as a father for uh, fueling yung, yung, yung fire din sa mga bata. Kasi alam naman natin na uh, pag natatalo, nanggigigil, gusto bumamit. So we'll use that positively on this moment. Coach, you mentioned already yung gig and everything, pero nga, you entered the tournament as a top seed. Do you think nagkawa pa ng sense of complete complacency kaya ayun, nag-discussion kayo in the end? This might be a top seed. It might be one of the, the factors, but uh, there are a lot of things to say na nangyari. Uh, the, only, uh, the only thing that I'm really sad about is the schedule really dito. Kasi, we could have, uh, we could have like, parang um, nagtago ng strats and stuff. Fortunately, we have to show it's IESF, so, you know, uh, yeah, that's that's one of the uh, sad things when you have a this year, so, but, you know, uh, as happens, so. <laughs> yeah, you mentioned that there are many categories of skills, but you have to force to keep putting it up. You think in day one, by the way, it's a bit of a confidence in Parang siguro may sense of gigging na gusto yung maglaro na agad para makapalis na kayo for Friday or what? Um, not really. Siguro... Yeah, I think... Uh, mahihirap sagutin eh. Kasi... But, but, but in my opinion... Uh, it's, it's just the follow through yung ano eh. Dun sa plano namin yung... Uh, main downfall na of the season. Hello, coach. Hello. Um, good season, nonetheless. Um, I would just like to ask, um, if you were to give, like, um, which player do you think stepped up the most this season? So, uh, oh. I think it's old way. That's what I'm saying, Mark. Coach, sa tingin mo ba naka-affect sa team performance din siguro yung ang dami niyong pinag-prepare na tournament, MPL, bukod sa schedule na sabi mo kanina, MPL, IESF, tapos sa Seabon, kasi sobrang dikit nila. Yeah. Uh, nagkaroon ba ng parang fatigue or burnout yung mga boys dun sa sobrang close na big tournaments? Uh, fatigue, no. But it's the scheduling that I'm mostly uh, disappointed about, really. Uh, I like I like the other teams na naglalaro dito sa MPL. You know. I'm not making excuse by the way. <laughs> I'm just saying uh, this could have been or this could have been done better uh, in terms of scheduling. But fatigue, no, because they gusto gusto talaga nila maglaro. Unfortunately, uh, all those uh, team dynamics na pinapractice na namin, we just basically have to show it off to Zai and so we 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 had to qualify. So yeah. Follow-up question. Uh, now that uh, out of the way in the NBL campaign, you know, so you're focusing on uh, the next step, which is uh, SEA Games, which is already ongoing. How uh, confident are you that what you learned here is what you will do for us to get the gold medal in the SEA Games? I personally feel that we have a lot of learning in these matches here in the sa NBL season 11 playoffs at matututunan pa kasi hindi pa naman tapos yung, ano, yung playoffs so we're still waiting for them like, to show us uh, some more strategies some more gameplay itong mga nalitirang clips so sana may ma-pick up kami and magamit namin siya sa sa sea games Good 
could you just talk us through um, what's next for the team? Like, tipat na po ba yung hagan for Cambodia? Or may a few days kayo na siguro rest, hard earned rest? Mm, wala kami time for rest really. Because we're flying on the 9th of this month. So that, that's like, uh, what, three days from now. So uh, right now I'll give them time to like chill, you know, uh, gather themselves. Because we're still not done. So we still have to train. So who was, uh, we'll definitely pick up pace again. <laughs> and, uh, you know, just make sure that we continue where we left off. Because if we're going to go back, we're going to then we think that we're going to go back to the game. I don't think it makes sense. So, what I'm saying to them is that we're going to go back to the game. And what I'm saying is that we're going to go back to the game. And we're going to go back to the game. And we're going to go back to the game. As far as the team of the team, or as the leader of the team, what do you want to say to your teammates, mo, especially with a tough loss like this? And see, since the next week, may bago ay yung um, challenge niya face. Um, siguro yung masasabi sa akin lang yan. Uh, hindi na yung ano, yung mga bagay na ano, na nangyari na. Kasi hindi na namin makakontrol yun. Yung mga dapat namin gawin na. Nangyari na yun. Tapos kailangan mas maging mas focus kami sa mga susunod na pwede mangyari para sa amin. Para mas mapaganda namin. Thank you. And good luck po sa CDM. Saka coach and uh, you. Uh, so earlier you mentioned about uh, scheduling concerns. Like uh, on your end, like is there anything that can be done to like address like the uh, scheduling issues that was that you mentioned? Yes, if it was possible in Indonesia to have like a month uh, a tournament, why can't we do it here? That's probably one of the lingering questions in my head. That's my only question. And, uh, yeah, Thank you. Um, my question po, for the both of you. Um, during this season, which game is the most notable for you? Uh, or which game did you learn the most from? Which game? Sa mga na alaban nyo, ano yung game na pinakatingin mo is? pinakamaganda for you and ano na rin? Siguro ano, yung pagpasok ng trails. Tapos, ang dami namin natutunan dun sa laban namin na ganyan sa Blackless and Diego na. Siyempre, hindi kung ano yung huling namin ka sa regular season na ganun pa rin yung money pwede nyo lang gawin. Kaso, pagkakamali namin dun pa rin. Hindi kami, parang nag-stick kami sa kung saan lang kami wala kaso namin parang pinay na bago. Tapos, yun pa, pinay pa namin labanan yung Blackless sa meta nila. Parang malaking pagkakulang din kasi sa amin na anay na hindi namin kaya mag-end up sa mga magkakaibang playstyle. Kung gusto namin mag-champion, kailangan kaya-kaya namin yan eh. Tulad na yung meta ng Black is sustained. Tapos pagdating sa Echo, biglang puro heavy pick-off. So yun, kailangan kaya namin lahat yun kung gusto talaga namin mag-champion. Kaya siguro hindi para sa amin yun. Thank you po. What's next for um, Brent? Like, um, there's Sea Games in Cambodia this month, and then, um, you know, there's Ria, there's Romania, and there's the possibility of Indonesia. So, yeah, uh, the this month we're, we're flying to Cambodia for the Sea Games. And then uh, for me, Song and Dub, uh, first week, uh, actually, I told the second week of June, I'll be flying again back to Cambodia for the same fire games and then obviously what happened with MSC we're out of uh, the tournament we uh, have <laughs> a flight to Riyadh which is on Sunday and then August is you know hopefully we qualify uh, for yes Romania so that's basically uh, our entire calendar for the year with the exception of course of the MPLC is involved and the uh, probability of, ha of participating in the MCs. Um, all the best to the team. Thank you. Thank you. Once again, uh, Brand is